Hey guys, my name is Mon and today I'm going to be showing you how to do a really minimal and simple eye makeup look using Swish Beauty's products. So the look I'm going for is super simple. I just want to focus on my eye area and my eyebrows because that's usually what sticks out when I'm wearing my mask. So I'm going to be using their Liquid Like Eyeliner, um, their Bubble Blush in shade Flush for my cheeks and then the Beach Brow for my eyebrows in shade 2. As you can tell, I'm not wearing any foundation or concealer. I personally don't like to wear it, especially when I know I'm going to be wearing a mask for most of the day. The look I'm going for is just focusing mainly on my eyes and my eyebrows and just a bit of my cheeks. So I'm going to start off by using the Beach Brow in shade 2. Um, my eyebrows are quite full already, as you can see. So it's mainly just to fill them out and define them just a little bit more. What's really nice about Beach Brow is that, firstly, it's really small and compact, which is so nice to carry around with you. And if you just need to do a bit of touch-ups. The brush also is really nice and small. So it's perfect for your eyebrows. And... What I like to do is just start from the front and just lightly brush. I go with the grain just so that all the hairs are lying in the same direction. But what you can do is brush against the grain and then go with the grain again, if that makes sense. Um, if you want a bit more volume, but I just like to brush up in the center and then from here just fan it out so you can tell the difference in my eyebrows um this is also my better one by the way <laughs> so i always start with the better one um this one is a little bit flatter so i try and like puff it out a little bit more and brush the hairs up a little bit more but generally my eyebrows are quite uniform i don't know why we always have to have one that's just doing its own thing so if you want to you can definitely brush over the same area a couple times you can even like go back and forth between your eyebrows like once the product is set um, it dries super quickly so it's really convenient and it doesn't transfer which is really lovely um, but if you do want a little bit more volume or it to be standing up like your, your hairs to stand up a little bit more then you can go over the same area again and it'll give you that more voluminous look so there we go i've got my eyebrows done and yeah you can definitely tell that i've got one that's not the same shape but it's fine like everyone's got a weird ugly twin of an eyebrow <laughs> So now that my brows are done, I'm going to be moving on to my eyes and I'm going to be using the Liquid Luck Eyeliner. The tip is so fine, so you really can't go wrong. I mean, I'm quite an amateur myself, so if you don't have much experience applying liquid eyeliner, this is really a great product um, if you're still learning or even if you're a pro, but I'm not a pro. <laughs> I'm going to be going for just a really small, simple, lifted eye look. Um... I don't want the big cat eye for me if i know i'm just wearing minimal makeup then it's really nice to just have something that makes it look like your eyes like slightly lifted so yeah this product is perfect for that so what i like to do is start applying the eyeliner from the outside and move it inwards because i find that if i do it the other way I kind of don't really know where to end and then I just end up going almost to my hairline. <laughs> you kind of just want to start where you want to finish already and then just like bring it inwards. So as you can tell I've just done a little line there. Um, I'm just going to go over it a couple times. So yeah it's really tiny but i don't like crazy eyeliner and this is also nice because it goes really well in between your lashes which also makes your lashes look fuller so i'm just gonna fill this area a bit and yeah that's pretty much done now to get the other side exactly the same so 
so that's my eyes done um i'll just be putting a bit more mascara on just to fill out my eyes Lastly, I'm going to be applying the Bubble Blush in shade Flush. What's really nice about Bubble Blush is that the consistency is super smooth, super matte. Like while you are applying it, which you really don't need a lot of, like I'm literally using the tiniest bit. Um, you just dab it on the area of your cheek that you want it and you just smooth it over. It blends in with the texture of your skin really well. So you don't have to worry about it looking cakey or anything. It kind of just tints your cheeks, which is really nice. I'm just going to apply a little bit over here too, just to give myself a bit of color on my eyelids. I don't know if people do this, but I apply blush on my nose sometimes. So that's my cheeks done. And I'm just going to finish off with some superhero spray. Of course, I literally love this product so much. So that is my look done. Um, it's a really, really simple and easy look to do for when you know you're going to be wearing your mask for most of the day. So just to show you, um, wearing a mask doesn't actually cover up any of the look um, that I've done today because I just really focus on this area of my face. So yeah, it works really well and you can still look super cute while wearing your mask.